Bay Area. This is your reporter on Channel 9, Owen Lucas. Our story tonight is on the indigenous species almost eradicated by the black shelled mussel. Some of the facts are that they are generally small and fragile shells that have a massive impact on the environment as they can colonize very easily. The mussels were highly numerous in 1999 Dar in Darwin, Australia. They were brought in by boats in which they were on the hull. When the boat was at port, the larvae settled on the ocean floor and bred and increased their population size until they were too numerous to even fight back. As it turns out, the black striped mussel is ambisexual, meaning it can change its gender as it pleases and it can breed incredibly quickly. Darwin officials quarantined the area and exterminated all the mussels, which they thought would stop the problem for good, although there, also, there are signs today that it could possibly return. Currently, officials are worried that the ships coming in and helping with mining in Queensland, Australia, will bring in new pests like the mussels that will harm the Great Barrier Reef ecosystem and other ecosystems within their reach, which would this would choke out oysters and indigenous species in that ecosystem and marine environment. In closing, to prevent further population of black striped mussels in Australia, in Australia, marine officials have cut off all possessions of the mussels without permits. No mussels on your vessels. Well, we're out of time. This is Owen Lucas from Great Barrier Reef, Channel 9.